Salut tout le monde, c'est Urko, on se retrouve sur Everspace 2 pour l'épisode 12, c'est parti Ok les amis, alors on va continuer notre mission principale, on doit se rendre sur Seto. Donc voilà, on va prendre le portail. Ok, donc nous sommes arrivés ici sur cette eau. Et notre mission, on doit retourner à la base. Pour voir Elec. Ok, par là-bas. Hey Elec, you want to talk about it? Talk about what? You not working for Kato anymore? Nah, I'm good. If they hadn't fired me, I'd have quit myself. I'm a free spirit, you know? Can't stay long in one place. Besides, I can't wait to see your place. If you live there, it must be lit. Actually, I'm the one who lives there the least. There are others. Nice! I love meeting new people. The forthcoming clash of personality types locked down on a remote asteroid should provide some fascinating fireworks. Ben, Delia, I'd like you to meet my friend Alec. He'll be staying with us. We are gonna have so much fun! <laughs> Great! It'll be good to have a happy face around. Come on, I'll show you the base. Lead on, half robot man. Hey Adam, may I have a word with you? Sure, what is it? This little furry thing is your friend, you say? Oh yeah, we go back. And you brought him here because you actually care for him? Yeah. I still can't figure you out, Adam. But I need to ask you a favor. There was supposed to be a second cargo drone that was shipped along with the one I was in. Any idea where it could have ended up? It's probably at the G&B station where they try to send you to. I don't know which one that is. I didn't even know they were shipping me into the DMZ at all. I could get the station ID from the servers at Naria Transit Point, then ask around. I have a few contacts at G&B. Should be no big deal. I need to head back to Prescott soon, but I can try to slip this in somewhere in between. Thank you, Adam. That would be very helpful. Sure, it's the least I can do. Ok, une mission secondaire qui consiste à aider Delia, notre un de nos compagnons. Elec nous a rejoint. Donc, qu'est-ce que Elec nous permet de faire Soutien offensif. Le redoutable Elec vole parfois à la rescousse pour abattre les ennemis d'Adam s'il est d'humeur. Améliore les armes d'Elec en puissant canon magnétique. Elec attaque également avec des missiles IEM. Oui, ça serait intéressant de l'avoir lui euh, pour nous soutenir dans notre bataille. Déjà, je vais prendre le premier niveau. Ah, de l'alcool hein, pour améliorer son truc. Voilà. Est-ce qu'on peut prendre le suivant Oh, il lui faut un égalisateur. D'accord, il demande déjà un petit peu de crédit. Ça, on peut lui filer ça tout de suite. Et il veut un égalisateur. Est-ce qu'on peut le fabriquer Alors, arme principale. Canon magnétique. Je pense que c'est ça. Hein. Allez, on voir. Est-ce que c'est bien ça Ils disent égalisateur, mais ça ressemble à un canon magnétique. Ou peut-être c'est une ressource qu'il faut acheter. Parce que là j'ai un plan de canon magnétique. Voyons voir quelque chose. Je pense que ça doit être ça. D'ailleurs, ouais non ça c'est juste pour dire que c'est nouveau. Allez, on va tester. On va tester. D'accord. On en a fabriqué un, maintenant on va aller voir dans les talons. Ah non, c'est pas ça. C'est vraiment un égalisateur qu'il lui faut, donc on doit le trouver dans un magasin. Et voyons voir si euh, l'égalisateur peut nous servir à nous. Ah, dommage que ça soit en... quand même 192. 314. 
Mmh, c'est pas très grave. Ah tiens, ben, on va faire la mission de notre coéquipière. Jamais sans mes affaires qui est juste, qui est juste, qui n'est que de niveau 10. Et il se trouve sur ses taux, ça tombe bien. Alors la carte, tiens, c'est ici. Allez, on va s'y rendre. Y'a pas de problème. This place is a lot more crowded than I remember it. Let's see what this is about. A mon avis, ils vont m'attaquer. Hein. Ouais. On va pas prendre de risque. Quoi, il s'est rechargé ou quoi Ah non, c'était pas lui. Un autre vaisseau qui se trouve en arrière-plan. Ah ben tiens, il y a plusieurs vaisseaux. C'est clair. Mais toi Ah tiens, je vais tester mon téléporteur. Oh, stylé. Où est-ce qu'il est celui qui me carnade Calibre égalisateur. Regardez ça. Waouh. Il est vraiment pas mal. Et lui, il a son truc. Putain, il lui faut un missile IEM. Déjà, on va lui donner ça. Ok, alors. Pleine de Nenfis. C'est 
c'est censé être nos amis ici, hein, donc euh, on va voir. Excellent, thank you. Losing a full-blown doctor was just as bad as getting our provisions halved. Maybe worse. As it stands, I have two miners in Medbay with only an unskilled AI operator treating them. So, should you ever find out what happened to the lost doctor, don't hesitate to tell us. I'll look into it. I am certain you will. Godspeed, Mr. Roslin. It was good seeing you again. Okay. On continue notre petite mission. Quoi mais qu'est-ce qu'ils font là ceux-là Il oh, y a de la corrosion. Je sais pas ce qui s'est passé. C'est une mine là-bas À faire du délire. Parfait. You're back. It's been a bit of a journey, but is this what you've been looking for? Looks about right. Let me check. A friend of mine called Shaw told me where to find it. He's the chief officer of Neftis Station. That's where they were shipping you. He's a good guy. Told me losing a doctor put them in a pretty tough spot. Oh, damn it. What is it? Those bastards took my research files. I had made certain that they would be shipped along with me, but G&B must have removed them after they froze me. What kind of research? Medical stuff. You wouldn't... Sorry, I don't want to take this out on you. It just looks like G&B screwed me over far worse than I had thought. So, what were you saying about this Shaw? 
Forget it. It's not important. They're missing a doctor, huh? I'm not very keen on moving to their base, but I could set up a secure line and talk to them. If they have any medical emergencies, I might be able to assist them remotely. You are aware that they're G&B, right? I do, but I am a doctor above all else. Once again, I'm walking back into my forest with open eyes. Um... It's a reference to a song. At least my books and music are still in that box. It will keep me sane for a while. What kind of books? All sorts. Guilty pleasures, high art, most of it pre-offworldian stuff. But I like it. Hey, once things have calmed down a bit, I could give you an introduction. I would like that. Good. We have an appointment. Well, I gotta get back to my lab. Thanks again, Adam. You're welcome. Ok, ok, donc on l'a fait assez rapidement cette petite mission là. Donc on retourne sur notre mission principale. Avant, ah on va quand même se renseigner un petit peu. Alors, parlez à, parlez à monsieur Kaito au palais de Kaito. Ok, d'accord, il n'y a pas de souci. Monsieur Kaito m'a confié une mission de contrebande, oui, bien sûr. Allez, j'espère qu'il me dira où se trouve ma doc. Et voilà, palais, nous voici. Well, look who it is. You're dealing with me from now on. Hi, Daryl. So, now I get to know where Maddox is for real, right? Yeah, he leases the biggest hangar in Avonrest, a settlement here in Union. But so far as what kind of reception you're gonna get when you arrive there, we hold no responsibility. Maddox has good reason to be a deeply paranoid individual. Who else has been looking for him? Hard to say. It's just murmurs on the wavelengths. Okay, see you around. Oh, hey, before you leave, in case you're interested in doing us more favors and earning some credits, talk to Marianne over here. Sure, as long as she doesn't have anything else up her sleeves. I do not understand. Oh, wait, you are referring to your first visit. An unfortunate incident. I extend my apologies. It's quite all right, Marianne. It was out of your control. So, what can you offer me? Please let me inform you about the station's job board. I have the clearance to inform you that there are jobs of special interest if you succeed in doing some of these. I'll have a look. Okay, cool. Donc, on a débloqué les tâches ici. Bon, mais les, les tâches, c'est des trucs que je fais en solo. En solo, ben non, pas en solo, mais que je ne fais pas euh, en enregistrement. Et... Si on va regarder un petit peu quand même avec vous. Ouais, il y a quelque chose. Euh, ils sont assez haut level. Hein, moi, il y aurait que ça. C'est intéressant. Qu'est-ce qu'il me donne des graines Non, missile anti-armure. Ok. Mais au moins, ça fait remonter ma renommée. C'est cool. Et ça donne du crédit. Donc là, acquisition de talent. On va faire celle-ci, acquisition de talent. Choisir une mission du clan Keto. Ok, je dois... Bon, ben, je vais prendre celle-ci. La plus simple. Terminer les missions du clan Keto. Donc, je dois terminer deux. Mission du clan Keto. Les deux autres les sont un peu haut level donc il faudrait que je up un peu. Si vous jouez, je vous conseille pas de faire des missions qui sont plus haut niveau que vous parce que c'est vraiment la galère. Après ça, livraison de ramen. Ça doit pas être compliqué ça. Combien de ramen tu veux Ah, il faut prendre le contrôle de la zone de livraison. On va quand même continuer la mission principale. On, on ne l'a pas terminé donc ce serait bien de, la, de le terminer avant de passer à autre chose. Donc, c'est parti to make three deliveries using our ramen drones. If you fail to make a delivery in time, a small percentage will be deducted from your payment. Ramen drones? I bet it's not even ramen they're carrying. Please, be careful with the drones. They can be difficult to control. If one of the drones is destroyed, you will not receive any payment for that delivery. I'll do my best. I really thought I had graduated from menial tasks. Finalement, 
Ils veulent qu'on le fasse tout de suite. Bon, allez, on va faire une de ces. On va faire la livraison de ramen ensemble. Ça change un petit peu des autres choses. De toute façon, là, on doit piloter un drone. Ok. Ah oh. Les avoués sont pas simples. Mais où est-ce que je dois le livrer Ah là-bas. Wow à l'intérieur oui on dirait que c'est à l'intérieur Quoi, c'est pas à l'intérieur? Oh là là! la tâche mais non <rire> échec de la tâche oh là là bah c'est vraiment pas simple hein. Allez, au moins on aura testé. On part trouver Madoc. Hive, what can you tell me about Avonrest? Unfortunately, there is nothing in my latest iteration on Avonrest. If you had allowed me to update, I would perhaps be able to tell you more. But I can at least ascertain that it is an unofficial category of location, given there is no record. Okay. State your business before entering. I'm just here to check out the leasing on some anger space. Do you have an appointment? Not really. I was just hoping to knock around. Well, the Coalition operates a clean enterprise, so we don't want any trouble, okay? Huh. The Coalition running the place and no trouble? That's a change for them. I'll have to ask Alec what happened between him and these guys. Ok, là c'est une autre... Là on va nous donner des missions secondaires. Nous, c'est là-bas qu'on veut aller pour l'instant. Talk. Where is Dax? Where's his body? I buried him on Rhodia Station. The base? So you know. Don't shoot. I have something to show you. I'm going to reach into my belt. Slowly. His biochip. How can I be sure it wasn't you who killed him for that? 
I shared a cell with him and we escaped together. I helped him get the base set up again while he made plans to reach you. Give me that thing. <laughs> you got me. I guess I ain't as spry as I used to be. Yeah, right. I bet I ask the questions now. This chip, what does it lead to? You mean he didn't tell you? Dax offered me a cut. Said it was a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. And this rig you're building here just confirms to me that it's a big Viridian mining operation. Hold on there, fella. Don't you know what the Okar would do if they heard there was even talk about Viridian mining? Strictly prohibited by the treaty. Look, are we gonna cooperate or not? What are you doing? Well, you seem like a decent enough kind of guy. Come on upstairs and let's have a proper talk. You've come at the worst possible time or the best possible time. I ain't sure yet. But I do know I'm short on friends at the moment. With the Okar on the threshold about to kick the door down, and from what I hear, the G&B scouts chasing down rumors of my whereabouts, things are looking tight. Have a drink. The crap that took out Dax had a G&B signature. Hmm. That's no surprise, but to be honest, I got everyone breathing down my neck at the moment, and the local situation here is getting bad. The Okar are becoming pretty testy. Yeah, I know, and I can't launch. If they get one sniff of this rig, my ass is grass. So, you came all this way. What's your big plan? Uh, no, this is as far as the plan got. Ah, damn it. I was hoping you had an idea. Tell me, this Viridium find, think it's worth it? Oh, hell yeah. I've been waiting years for this. One quick excavation and we'd be set for life. All you need to do is get this freighter off the settlement without the Okar seeing you. I'll have to figure out some way to slip you out unnoticed. Boy, you are gonna be one of the richest men in the galaxy. So you spent years putting this freighter together. Yep, while Dax was back at the base twiddling his thumbs. But it was all part of the plan to keep the team separated until the time was right. Who else is in your team? You don't need to worry about that right now. Unless you get me off this station, the plot ends here. I hate to say it, but that won't be easy. You're flying a Viridian mining rig. The Okar can smell a setup like this from light sex away. You seem to know a lot about these things. Any ideas on how to fix it? Well, the only way to fool the Okar would be to encrypt all sensory information coming from your ship. Optics, chemistry. It even needs to taste like cheap steel when you lick it. You'd need something like a material encryptor. That's right. You know that sort of tech doesn't really exist? At least not out here? And that's wrong. There's at least one person who designed such things, but uh, both Cato and I have always been careful not to do business with him. I think I know where this is going. Hey, you're good at pestering people. You even got me to come around. This guy has a station near the ice planet Volta. Follow these coordinates and you'll find it. You know, I'm putting my faith in you over this, Maddox. Like I said, it'll be worth it. D'accord. Et voilà. On a terminé notre mission, on a retrouvé Maddox, donc euh, là on a une nouvelle mission euh, de la fumée et des miroirs de niveau 13. Mais avant ça, on a deux autres choses à faire avant, donc acquisition de talent et pêche aux données. Donc pour faire ça, il y a deux missions euh, de tâches que je dois remplir. Ok, ok. On va aller voir c'est quoi les missions secondaires qui se trouvent euh, dans le coin. Il y a un autre port par là-bas. I detect heightened outlaw activity circling these coordinates. It is likely that you will become involved in a raid should you choose to dock here. C'est pas un problème. Hey, how did you find us? I have almost two dozen markers on my map. This was one of them. Scrap. This is bad. Uma, the distractors are offline. We're sitting ducks here. I'll fix them. But I might need someone to have my back in case those bastards show up. I'm used to this kind of stuff. I can cover you. All right. Set yourself up, then tag along. We don't have much time. Nouvelle mission. Ok, eux aussi, ici, ils donnent des tâches. Ok, et regardons 
Ok, d'accord, c'est aussi une mission de niveau 11. Allez, on va faire ça. Donc, je dois la protéger à mon avis. Pourquoi j'arrive pas à le toucher Il faut tous les vaincre.
think that's it. Thanks. Let's meet in the hangar. Ok, j'arrive. You saved our derrières out there. Pay him well, Tico. He deserved it. Here, does this account for your trouble? It's more than enough. If there is anything else we can do, we gave your ship clearance to bypass the distractors. Feel free to come back anytime. Merci. Cool. Donc je suis arrivé niveau 15, donc j'ai le droit à autre chose. Alors, excès de force. Les armes principales infligent 30% de dégâts énergétiques en plus lorsque le bouclier est entièrement chargé. Situation critique. Les coups critiques ont 30% de chance de générer une explosion qui inflige 50% des dégâts à la cible et aux ennemis à proximité. Sans répit. La capacité énergétique des armes augmente de 20% pour chaque outil de soutien installé. Hmm. Allez, je vais prendre ça pour le moment. Ah, je suis niveau 15, donc je vais prendre ça. En plus, là, j'ai Elite qui est déjà débloqué, mais Elite, je vais le prendre au niveau 20. Niveau 15, je vais débloquer ça. On récupère les récompenses ici. Et ça nous a donné ça, qui est vachement cool. Ça, 426-213. Ouais. Merci à tous d'avoir regardé cet épisode. On se retrouve très bientôt pour la suite de nos aventures. Ciao, ciao.